Pedro from Team Franco RC, and today we have another unboxing. Actually, it's a very special unboxing to me because um, we were able to get a uh, first delivery um, for the display only. So, our local hobby shop was able to sell this to me. Um, I know it's nothing new. We've seen many Traxxas Max unboxings by now, but this is our unboxing video. So, it's, uh, so here we have the Traxxas Max, orange. We have the wide kit, orange. And we have some Badlands, um, belted bad, Badlands for the Traxxas Max. Definitely recommend to get this. So. All right, guys, let's see here, let's see here. All right, first we're gonna have your remote, Bluetooth compatible. Uh, the Bluetooth module does not come with it. That's an extra 35 bucks. You can buy it on eBay or at your local hobby shop. Can't guarantee you the price at your local hobby shop, but it's different everywhere. You also get your owner's manual, your tools. Actually, for tools, you get two Allen keys and a, a wheel X hub and some kind of battery clip. All right, guys, here we go. Obviously, this is not the original packaging that yours is going to come in because this was first delivery. This was the, the display model. However, um, where it was displayed, luckily for me, it was one that nobody got to touch. And uh, there it is, guys. Uh, this is the model with the LED lights already installed. So as you can see, you have lights here. You have lights in the rear. The vehicle does come with a wheelie bar. Um, the wide kit is actually going to help uh, make the wheels a little bit wider out. So when I install the Badlands, they're not going to be rubbing all over the place. So definitely the wide kit is a must. Now um, this bad boy, I'm not going to lie to you, it's, it's, it's pretty heavy uh, compared to like a Rustler 4x4 or something like that. I would say it's hefty. It's, 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 it's up there in the weight class. Uh, you do get some cool benefits, just like the Rustler 4x4, uh, the E-Revo 2.0, the Traxxas X-Max, you have the uh, clipless body. Let's see, that one actually came out pretty nice. There you guys have it. Okay, let's put that to the side here. And in here you have a, a pretty sweet setup. So it does come with some orange shocks, um, that's pretty cool pretty nice shocks you get your um, VXL 4s which is actually pretty big I wasn't expecting it for it to be that big it's, it's about the size of a of a, of a 6s or an 8s uh, uh, combo or ESC from Traxxas um, you do get your motor I believe is a 540 XL don't quote me on that because I'm not sure this model of course you get the uh, high voltage power amplifier for the lights that does bind with your um, Bluetooth module. So when you download the app, you can control the lights, um, dimness, turning them off, I believe turn signals and, and, and brakes and stuff like that. Uh, I gotta play with it myself to give you guys a better idea, but it's already all zip tied in um, and put together. Yeah, you got your little antenna covered there. You do have a, a fan for your ESC and you do have a fan for your motor, already all installed. It's ready to go. Um, see how that comes up, there we go. Slide a battery in. Yeah, guys, I mean, I would say overall, it's a, it's a pretty nice truck. It's, it's, it's a little mini X-Max. Uh, for those that haven't watched the other 100,000 unboxing videos, sorry I'm late, but yeah, I like this thing. Um, yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I'd say uh, maybe uh, I'm gonna check out how long these uh, plastic drive shafts last. Uh, definitely gonna, before I even run it, put the wide kit on it just because 
I don't believe that these uh, Badlands are going to, well, maybe they will. But check it out. That's the difference with the, uh, with the Badlands. Versus the stock, which I think they're going to look pretty good. So, yeah. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. That's what you get with your uh, Traxxas Max purchase. Now, they are, if I'm not mistaken, $5.99 um, plus the light kit. Um, some hobby shops may include the light kit in their deal. Um, but it's not a bad truck. Um, I would say if, if you're in the fence between buying this and a Haas, I would say definitely go with this one um yeah i uh, look forward to running it and seeing you know what it can do and i'll keep you guys posted on how it performs uh thanks for watching and as always keep doing that rc thing